Uh, good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Today I'm going to talk about lesson number 17, uh, five steps to break through your English speaking. Uh, today I will share step number four, uh, recite. Before I speak step number four, I will speak again step number one, two, and three. Okay, let's start. Step number one, setting goal and setting the best emotional state. You must conquer English to get opportunity. Working at international company, international group. Almost international companies require you to have English skill, and it is the first important skill you must have. Without English, you stop dreaming to go for foreign companies. Uh, even though you are good or not good at your English major, you must pass the English first exam of those companies. This means you will fail at the first recruitment exam if you don't have good English skill. Sooner or later, you must study English. And to have good emotional state, the thing you need to have is energy. When you have energy, you have everything. Energy when studying will start you learn English easily and fast or fail forever. Let's practice to have the best emotional state. Don't make it complicated in learning English. Believe in me, speaking English can be a piece of cake. Uh, simply start opening your mouth and start practicing super English. You sure you can do it. I'm sure you can do it. Uh, step number two, practice international mouth muscle with gesture pronunciation. It's the best method of practicing pronunciation and improving your international mouth muscle. Uh, this method will help you learn English immediately uh, and get progress so fast. With this method, you don't need to have talents or potentials of English. Just be ready, move your hands and use your mouth. Uh, so easy it is to pronounce English and build up your international muscle. Um, in this step, you will read out each word, each sentence. Uh, don't worry when you cannot read them correctly at the first time. Uh, to speak English correctly, you need a little bit time to improve your mouth muscle. And we will use this method in interesting special super English lesson. Uh, after practicing 46 American standards mouth muscle, 46 English sounds, you will we, we move to next steps easily. Uh, step number three, memorize. This is the most important step. Don't think you will suffer with memorizing English. Remember an interesting thing that English will help you to become a great person with awful memorizing English. The most simple way to memorize that anyone can practice is to repeat, repeat, and repeat again. With first lesson, it may take you 20 times reading again and again, but uh, even more than 20 times. Uh, but uh, after some first lesson, you see memorizing English is so easy. Just need to repeat reading 5 to 10 times uh, super English lesson. Uh, you sure can restart the lesson easily. Um, and don't forget to practice the rules I shared you before. Speak English as loud as possible. Speak English as clearly as possible. And then try to speak English as clearly as possible. Uh, step number four, recite. Um, this step, we do not speak out the lesson normally. You need to practice the rules. You need to practice speaking loudly and confidently in front of as many people as possible. And it will be much better when you have chest to stand on super English magic state. This is the most wonderful tool. Uh, and uh, magic state help you to build up your confidence in super English. A uh, confidence is a skill that you absolutely that you absolutely covered with super English. Uh, with super English, just stand on the magic state and show your English. If you want to be confident, you uh, if you want to be confident, come to super English. So many people uh, success and become confident with magic state. The next one is you. That's all step number four. See you step number five. Practice and communicate and communicate reality. Uh, thank you for listening. Bye-bye.